Welcome back. We got a, we got a guest today. My boy Emerson right here. You know what it is. You know what it is. Back with another lit video. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna be doing a fucking special ass split today. Competitive torque off. What are we hinted at? We're gonna see if he can throw uh, more ass today. So I I like. I on a real note though. What are we hitting? Today we are doing three lifts. We're gonna start off with deadlift. Um, I'm doing two sets of five, but I'm gonna work up to it. And then after that, we're gonna be doing overhead press. And then after that, we are gonna be doing five sets of five. And then after that, we are doing barbell rows, bent over. Bent over barbell rows. All right, let's get this shit. Okay, we are about to get warmed up right now. Um, I'm just gonna do some dynamic warm up. I don't like to do any stagnant before I work out because it's just bad for your muscles. You're going to pull something if you try to stretch cold and then go work out. Rubber band analogy, right? You pull a rubber band when it's cold, it'll snap. You warm it up first, it'll 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 stretch out. So we can do a dynamic warm-up, get our muscles warm, get a little bit of sweat going. We're going to go hit this uh, compound lift split. It's going to be fire. God damn, my boy. Got them new lifting shoes. Dang. All right, we just got our warm up in. Uh, there you go. Did some wrestling. That was fire. Knees actually feeling pretty good. If you want to learn how to warm up well, Google fucking Penn State wrestling warm up tournament or whatever. Watch what they do to warm up. That's the best, most dynamic warm up you could ever get. Specialized Kobe style warm up. That's right. That's right. All right, let's get this. All right, we're about to have some deadlifts right now. Um, gonna do warm up. We got no weight on the bar, but this guy's gonna run me through his routine. He's the coach here, so let's get this. You wanna start warming up? Yeah. Bend the knees. Tip, tip, tip. Keep your back flat. Tuck your chin. Retract your shoulder blades. Sink. You heard him. That's some W form right there. Watch closely. Some people do it different. Some people will start here. Some people bend their knees first. Mm -hmm. It's whatever you like. It's good for your shoulder blades to do double underhand. Mm -hmm. When you go heavy, you probably switch it up though. Yes, sir, it looks good. Just one. I just hit legs yesterday, so this is going to be quite the workout. Got the 35s on now, a little more weight, got to keep that back straight, don't fish and pull it. Watch this technique, watch this master craft. Slogan is, make sure you're arching. <laughs> Arch your back or you break your grandma's back. This is set number three. We're warming up. But yes. Yeah. This is my working weight. I'm gonna do two sets of this of five. I may go up by like five pounds on each side on the next set, but this is pretty much it. <laughs> 135 pounds. Awesome. He's going to go heavier. That's how he gets these lifts. 
training for the world record glute spread. What weight are we putting on now? Probably fives. You know fives? Fives? Yep. Yeah. Three small increments. Small increments. <laughs> He's like, what the fuck? I was actually... Alright, believe it or not, it's the last set. Believe it or not. Last set. Last set. And that'll conclude the deadlifts for the day. What's next? Overhead press. Overhead press, baby. Overhead press, baby. We're rolling. We're, we're recording. We're taping. All right, Emerson's going to demonstrate some immaculate form. Notice how he arches the back. If you can't hear him, his hands are right on the edge of the rough part. Pinkies. Barely touching the smooth. <laughs> How many subscribers is this channel at? Like 42 million. I think he's at 42 million subscribers now. What do you have to say to your fans? Don't try to assassinate the president, former president. It's probably a pretty fire tip right there. Uh, follow your dreams. Don't do drugs unless you're in a safe environment. Or an unsafe one. It, what it really boils down to is, are you a full Latuvian or are you a Jill Yang? I didn't even think about that. That's a really good point. So, that didn't even cross my mind. If you're not asking yourself these questions, are you really in Clark Pan? You're not a real Clarkster. A clark -Atugian. If, if you don't uh, ask yourself these heavy questions, right? Jill Yang, rise up. He said he's going to fill up on this weight. All right, he said we're doing five sets of five. One thing to note is we're doing free bar rows, so there's a lot more core activation, a lot more core work going into this to keep his back straight. If you're doing it on Smith, that's a really good idea if you're new to this movement. Free bar uh Weight for this move is going to be about 10 pounds less, give or take, than your Smith. First set, yeah. That's a good movement right there. This will make your deadlift go up. A little on the lighter side, but you don't want to go too heavy. And throw your back out on these. Pause. All right. This is working set number two. Remember to start light with these. Engage your core really heavy. Try to work away from doing these on Smith. Top secret gym. It's a top secret, specialized, invisible. Detective style gym. 
technique. I mean, that's not hard. <laughs> <laughs> you don't really got to go up and wait with these at all, honestly. Once you get your warm up sets done and your technique sets done, this is a tough movement. Another thing to note is you want to really retract those shoulder blades on this movement. Don't just don't just pull like you're doing a pull up, but go past that point. All right, pull up. You're stopping here, but you want to keep moving past and squeeze the shoulder blades together. It's a small difference, but it makes a huge difference. Eight billion percent hypertrophy. If you're pulling uneven with your weights, that doesn't inherently mean you have a muscle imbalance. That's just kind of meaning that you're pulling or pushing harder with one side, which leads to a muscle imbalance, which creates more pushing or pulling on one side. It's just exponential. So if you catch yourself lifting uneven, fix it before you have a muscle imbalance. Amazing technique. form is staying immaculate even through all of these sets. That can be mainly attributed to his core. For that guy that we saw earlier mm -hmm. that, you, that I met, I have a picture of him on my fridge. And that is 100% the truth. You may be wondering why. It's because, yeah. Dang. Yeah. Yeah. That's crazy. yeah. I would warm up with a set of pull ups for this, but we just did a bunch of back. So try to work towards adding weight. Insane gains. Don't just do 500 reps of pull ups if you're really good at them. Add some weight, make it hard. How much weight are you adding? Me personally, I really like 10 pounds. I get a good seven to eight reps out of that nothing too crazy anymore it gets really tough you want to aim for five reps at a minimum if you're adding weight if you can't hit five with weight drop the weight as soon as you can hit five <clears throat> consistently like for four sets i'd go up how do you add weight how do i add weight yeah do you have a belt right so you can order one online luckily this gym has one but there is a belt you use this is me from the future editing this video. Um, all of the weighted pull-ups were not recorded. I don't know why. I think I had a, an alarm go off when I was recording and I record on my iPhone, so that should just be recorded. Oh. I've been doing cardio for a little bit now. I'm about to get one more little burst of boxing in, stretch out, and then I'm going to head out. That's all from me. All right, just finished the workout. That shit was a W, what do you think? Hell of a good workout. Really good compound movements. Uh, you can see if I can't, you know, get this video edited down to not super long. That was a lot of a lot of footage. I'll try to get this down to like 20 minutes if I can, but this video might be hella long. On Monday or Tuesday, it's gonna be front squats, bench, and deadlift. 
definitely more enjoyable lifts than fucking bent over rows. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, but now it's just time for rest, some protein, chill Thanks. out, recover. Thanks. Get back after it. W. All right, that's it.